a lot of moms were telling me, oh, we're taking baby butts cream, we're mixing it half and half with coconut oil, and we're using it as sunscreen. It's amazing. I'm like thinking, oh, I can do better than that. 96% of all the sunscreens on the market right now are chemical based. It means it has either one or four of the top chemicals. They're hormone disruptors. And that's the last thing you want to do is use it on babies and children. How chemical sunscreens work is when you read the back of the label of a sunscreen, it'll say apply and then 15 minutes and then go into the sun. Well, I don't get it. What, what do you mean? It takes about that long to make sure it's absorbed into the skin. That's where the chemicals fight the UV rays inside your skin. You're going to have collateral cell damage. My product and uh, mineral and physical sunscreens work. It's immediate. You put it on, boom, you go in the sun right away. Zinc oxide is the only ingredient that's actually endorsed and recommended by both Health Canada and FDA to be a complete sunblocker of all the UV rays, not only A, B, but also C. Zinc oxide will sit on top of the skin, harmlessly reflects the sun's rays, like a mirror. That is what we need. The, the problem was the 4% that are out there, they have a hard time with the spread, spreadability and the stability. How we formulated this, as soon as you put it on, it actually dissipates into the skin because the oils and the waxes pull in the zinc as far as it can go. So I have the highest percentage of zinc allowed. We put ingredients in there for emollients. We put ingredients in there so it's very water resistant. I wanted to make sure that it's not only ref reflects the sun's rays, completely blocks them off, but also is good for the skin. The products I want to make, I want to help parents keep their babies and children safe. That is the whole reason why Elena's here.